Hi, today I'm going to show you how you can use an RTL SDR dongle to adjust your TV satellite dish or in other words to use it as a cheap satellite finder. We have a satellite dish, a small camping style, 45 centimeters set up here just for test purpose. We have an octagon uh, LNB which I'm normally using for 10 gigahertz reception. It's a PLL stabilized LNB but anyone will do for this purpose. What is important I have put a 20 dB attenuator here because the um, LNB has plenty of gain around 60 65 dB gain which uh, can easily saturate the RTL SDR. Then I have just a cable uh, into a bias T. This is a professional grade bias T but anyone will do. Uh, cheap DVB-T bias T for feeding antenna mounted preamps will do the same job. Uh, connect it to a variable power supply and we have the RTL SDR or DVB-T dongle here and we have SDR sharp running. So now if I uh, power up the LNB you can see the noise floor increases. Uh, we can see the noise level. If I power it down it's off again. Powering on, on and off you see the noise from the LNB on the screen. Now, how do we use it to set up the dish? First of all, you need to know uh, a frequency and the relative frequency you are receiving. I want to receive a satellite Telstar 12 and I know the uh, receiving frequency because I looked it up on the internet. And all I have to do is to deduct the local oscillator frequency of the LNB. Um, which is printed here on, on this sticker. Uh, it's uh, 9.75 gigahertz. You have to deduct that from your desired receiving frequency and then set up the resulting uh, intermediate frequency here in the uh, reception window. So now all we need to do is to uh, move the dish around until the signal picks up. Let's see if we can get a, a signal here. I have preset the elevation to an angle uh, corresponding to the satellite I want to receive so that I only need to change the azimuth left and right. And as you move the dish around you will see there are certain positions uh, where you will pick up an increase in noise. We see it here. Now I pass the point. Uh, here I pass the point, here is no signal. You can see it in the waterfall as well as in the uh, FFT. Uh, here is probably the sweet spot. Here we are. So we have maxed out the signal. Uh, the FFT has increased the noise floor. We can't see any actual signal because this is a wide band, very wide band, uh, phase shift keyed uh, digital satellite signal. So we can't see actual signal. So this noise that we are seeing is the actual signal.